Just two weeks after his wife Tammy died, Chad Daybell married Lori Vallow. Now this morning during Vallow's murder trial, Tammy's sister was back on the stand testifying to how crushing it was to learn that. Vallow is charged with conspiracy and theft in Tammy's death. She's also charged with murder, conspiracy and grand theft in the deaths of her two kids, JJ and Tylee. Tammy's sister, Samantha Gwilliam, testified that Chad told everyone Tammy was sick and woke up coughing and vomiting before she died in her sleep on October 19th, 2019. But when William saw her in the weeks before her death, she was healthy. So William said she had a feeling something happened to her. After she discovered he remarried, Chad told her he and Lori connected because they were both grieving a dead spouse. She testified that Chad told her he and Lori wouldn't be raising any kids together. Six other people testified so far this morning, including law enforcement officers and the Fremont County coroners. Okay. Jurors heard the 911 calls the Daybell family made in October of 2019. First, when a masked man pointed that what looked like a paintball gun at Tammy while she was unloading groceries, followed by the call from Chad and his son the morning Tammy was found dead. In it, Chad tells the dispatcher Tammy is clearly dead and frozen. He's crying and distraught. The sheriff deputy and coroner who responded to her death testified as pictures of Tammy's body were shown, showing a pink foam on her cheek. They said her body was cold and had obviously been dead for a few hours by the time they got there. We learned earlier in his, this trial, Tammy was killed and died by asphyxiation. Our Morgan Romero is sitting in on today's trial, which will end at 1.30. She's going to bring you the biggest takeaways later on the news at 4.